My name is Caroline uh, Crisp. I'm the managing director of Straight Group Middle East. Um, in here, we are in the, the warehouse where we have most of the cars uh, that we sell. Um, the factory is based in Russell Kema, which is one of the seven Emirates of the United Emirates. So we are, as you know, one of the largest manufacturers of uh, armored vehicles in the world. Besides vehicles, we also have boats and we also produce our own armored glass, which we have a factory here as well. Business for 19 was amazing. We had a really, really good year with uh, yet again another support from our clients worldwide over all the continents. Uh, we've had an extremely good year. 2020 is looking very promising as well. Um, we have increased our sales target by 30% as well as the production lines. So we're really excited to start the new year. And um, so yeah, we're hoping for the best, but it's all good so far. We have a plan, uh, the, second, the third phase of expansion of the company, of the, the premises here in Ras Al-Khaimah. We are in the final designs of the, of the layout of the whole facility, so we will be building at least three more buildings on these grounds. Um, so I'm hoping that by next year I can announce the big opening of these buildings. Um, so yes, we are expanding. We have recently restructured the company as well, not letting people go, but in a professional way where we have reassigned people with their qualities into different departments so that we can really cater to a more corporate environment because over the years things have changed and we have come to realize that some adjustments were needed, so we've done that. And now with that in line that's been implemented, now we can start fresh and start with the expansion uh, phase three of the facility here. So initially the business started with the commercial vehicles. Slowly by slowly we started expanding the company. We didn't take it too fast. Uh, we had a proper R&D department installed as well that has their full separate building on the premises too. And then we established the facility here where we produced the cars. After which we came to realize that the glass that we uh, had on some of our cars wouldn't it was good, but it wasn't up to the expectations that we had from our glass. So that's when we launched the production here for our own glass. And funnily enough, we now sell it to some of our competitors as well. Uh, we give five years warranty for our own glass. And we can provide normal glass, laminated glass, but also up to B7 protective glass as well. Besides that, we have the Marine, Straight Marine, which was launched only a few years ago. Um, we have the capability of building boats in-house armored but also non-armored and we've come to realize with Marine that basically we needed to give this extra service to our clients where they don't only necessarily need vehicles or commercial cars or armored cars, they also need checkpoints, they need ride control cars, they need demining machines, uh, they need boats. So we are really trying to cater the full uh, market so that we can cater to all the needs. And it's a very important part actually for us where we've tried to really focus more on what our clients need. We don't want to sell what we produce. We more and more are working with the customers to understand what it is that they really need and we tailor build for them. And I think that that's one of the things that really sets us apart from the competition is not only having a large amount of vehicles in stock, but also to listen to them and to really cater and tailor the products to their needs. And that's with that in mind that we developed the cars, the ride control cars, the special cars, the military cars, the checkpoints, all the third party suppliers, uh, equipments that we can give, but also the glass and the boats. Now we had the chance to visit the showrooms of uh, Swright, including on this site the full range of combat vehicles, that's correct? Yes, correct. So we have behind us, you will see the, the MRAPs, a few of the amphibian vehicles as well. Um, as we walk, you will see a few of the APCs, the, the armored cars as well. And on the other side of the, of the alley here, we have all the commercial cars. I'll show you as well a few of them. Um, but yes, we have a very large amount of cars from MRAPs ranging to APCs to uh, normal SUTs. So the full range is here, more or less, so you can really see everything. So we count for the military side as well as the commercial side. It's very important for SWI to continue to develop new products and especially to respond to the new uh, request and also the new threats on the battlefield, on security field. Yes, absolutely. It's, it's a day-to-day -day, uh, interaction with our customers where we need to understand what is happening on the field. So we tailor 
the cars to what they need, so we redesign some of the cars that we have, as well as uh, improve on those we have. So I cannot disclose you yet what the new models are, but we obviously work on new models that can c cover uh, and cater to other needs. So this is the Bozina, it's a demining system that we use, it's controlled remotely with the, the system that you can see here. What it does, it basically allows you to plow through the ground and get the mines up so that they explode and we don't um, affect people's lives. Besides that, we have checkpoints, which obviously come in when customers need to have mobile units. We, we cater to those as well. We can create full offices in there uh, for the customers. And then we also have the riot control vehicles with side barricades, with water cannons. The client names it, we can make it.